Hold on, we gonna show y'all how to do it right though. Check this out. Well, what's up, everybody? I guess y'all heard the news. Osama bin Laden is dead. Yeah, when hell freeze over. But uh, they said that Osama bin Laden was shot and killed hours ago. <laughs> this came from the White House now. My house said, um, uh, I think we should tell the people that uh, Osama Bin Laden is dead. Is he? How do we know? We don't know he dead. They ain't got pictures, they ain't got videos, they ain't got shit to back it up. So how do we know that this motherfucker's dead? They, they can sit there and take DNA to see if he, if, if he is Bin Laden, they can take fingerprints. They're still not showing us that it's really him. They're just telling us. They're not giving us the evidence that we need. They ain't giving us the proof. They saying, oh, he's dead. That's what they said about Haddam Hussein. They said he was dead. They said he was dead. And what the, now what they say, they had him in custody. And what happened? They found out it was a look-alike. A look-alike. How do we know that they got the look-alike of Bin Laden instead of he, he, himself? We don't know, because they sitting up there jacking us off with the, we killed Bill Laden today. Did y'all? Where's body? How come y'all ain't showing his dead body on TV? Oh, maybe because they thinking, uh, kids? Maybe because, it's, because the kids don't want to see? Hold on, like I said, you gotta have the proof. The proof is in the pudding. The proof is in the pudding, dog. We gotta have that proof. If you ain't giving us that proof, we can't believe what the hell you say. If the people gotta prove themselves in a court of law, I think the government should prove themselves to us that they really killed this man and he's really dead. I'm talking about, I don't wanna see him in the, in the room when he's laying on that table, cut up. Show us that he's dead. Show us that he ain't living no more. Show he ain't moving. Show us that he's not a, a lookalike. Cause we don't know if he if he's really dead. We don't know. How should we know that he's dead? We don't know. We don't know that Ben Laden is dead because they telling us this. That's one thing that gets on my nerves. The the government tell oh we're gonna lower gas prices. When? I'm gonna do that tomorrow. Next day. I still gotta pay six dollars for gas. Thought they was gonna lower it. They ain't lowering it. They need to prove it. Like I said, the proof is in the pudding, and that's what we need. They're not gonna prove us, prove to us that he's dead. They're not gonna prove it. They're not gonna prove it, cause they they they're not gonna prove because they think, oh, cause we're the government, we can say anything we want and get away with it. Dude, you need to show us to make us believe that you're. That you really killed that person. That's all that is to it, man. You gotta show us that you killed this man. Don't tell us that you killed him. Show us. Show us his dead ass body. Show his turban wearing ass on the table. Cut the hell on up. If you're gonna say that he's dead, if you're gonna preach about it, make sure you show about it. Don't sit there and say, oh, he dead and he, he walked around. I see him down at the 7 Eleven selling slurpers now. Because if I see him down there selling slurs, I damn sure gonna be the maddest motherfucker on the block. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. I, I see if it's true, man. I, if it's true, I'm glad. Hey, look, man, they've chased the dude for years and years on end. They finally caught him. They did the same thing with what Haddam Hussein. They was chasing that brother for years. And what happened? They finally caught the brother, what, two or three years ago? And killed his ass off? Then a few years later, now they killing, now they kill Osama, which they have no proof that he, that they did. That's one thing. We don't know if he really did it. We don't know. We don't know if they really did. We don't know if that's really him. We don't know if that's a copycat. That's what we would need to know. The people need to know that that's really Osama bin Laden. That's what we really need to know. We really know need to know if that's really Osama bin Laden, because. Saying it is not helping us, showing us that it's really him. I mean, no dead, no no fake dummies that looks like him. No 3D images saying that it's him. No, 
no uh, photo bucketing or or, uh, or what is it uh, editing a picture saying oh that's him or video saying oh that's really him but it's some other guy we want to see this that he's really dead that's one thing we want to see we want to see that he's really dead we want to see that he's not living we want to see him he's not moving because if they say they did but it shows that they didn't they'll actually say they'll actually make the people more mad and quit trusting the quit trusting the government even more uh, how can we trust the government they say they killed Osama bin Laden I saw him down at the grocery store buying milk and eggs oh he's sitting there got right right hey man I see him bin Laden there man sitting there buying weed off me we don't know if this man is still dead like that you can say oh we matched DNA to to a relative of his or fingerprinting him that ain't telling us nothing that's just a piece of paper we want to see body that's what we want to see body we want to see a body that's all we want to see I want to hear about now. Oh, we killed Ben Laden, and then you come back the next day. Oh, we made a mistake. That's not really Ben Laden. That's some other guy that looks like him. Look, if y'all see, this is why you need to confirm that's really that one person. If you killed somebody that looked like him, just say, "Oh, well, we killed the person on an accident because we thought that he was Ben Laden, but he's not. So we actually going to take care of his family and all this and that." Don't say y'all killed somebody not having the proof to back your shit up, man. That's just lying to people. That's how that. That's how I see it. That's how I really see it. Now, now I'm kind of, kind of glad they did because I got tired of them damn video takes that Ben Laden been sending us. I don't know what he's been saying. He's kind of get on my nerves. He keeps sending video takes. We don't know what the hell he's saying, dude. We don't speak with speak your language. That's one thing. If you want us to know what the hell you're saying, make sure you do it in English. Do it in English and tell us what's, what you want. Don't do it in your native tongue because some of us don't know what the hell you want. We don't know if you want food, water, clothes, something. I'm not dogging him and saying he's a good guy or a bad guy. I'm just saying we don't know what the hell you're saying. But you see there's a clock right there saying May 1st, 2000. It says first day of May 2011 to 10 58 but that's how it is cause I'm posting this up on MySpace and YouTube and Facebook and I'm gonna I want y'all to tell me what you think about this topic don't sit there and say Joe you I don't see why you did this video I think it's stupid I don't want to hear that if you're gonna say that to me if you're gonna say that don't leave it on my comments don't do a video as much as gone so well with that I don't need it to some some other bullshit but if you like what you what I had to say, tell me what you think. Tell me what's going on on your mind, and all this and that. Do a video response and comment on what you think. And please subscribe to my page if you like what I had to say. And add me as a friend. Tell me who you are, because I'm not. Tell me who you are. What's up and all this and that. Leave a message, showing who, telling me where you see me from, with which video you watch. Hook me up. But uh, and I'm closing out in this video. I did a there's a contest on YouTube called Pitch My Movie. And I actually actually did a movie. I pitched a movie video. It's called Uncle Afro Joe's Summer. And uh the contest rules is that none of my family can vote for me and all like that and and the way to vote is people gotta give me the thumbs up on this video. So when you go to my YouTube page Go to, go search for that Uncle Afro Joe's videos and give me a thumbs up to help me win this contest to make my movie. To help me. It's not a porn movie. It's a family movie, a comedy family movie idea I came up with. Just go over there and give me thumbs up. Tell your friends to get, go over there and give me thumbs up. Friends, family, and other, so on and so forth to help me win this contest. If it's still up, that means if the video is still up either, the contest is still on or I won if the video has been taken down that means the video that means the contest is over so go over there and vote for my video go over there and give me the thumbs up on the on my video Uncle Afro Joe's summer help me win make this movie please thank you I hope I win this contest please and thank you help me out much love this is Afro Joe the Wookie holla at me
Yay, yay.